It's a long way from the laboratory to Christie's Auction House in London, but it's proved to be a very profitable journey for medical researchers at Sydney University. An anonymous donor gave the university a painting by Pablo Picasso on the condition that it be sold to fund medical research. Today, the painting of one of Picasso's lovers exceeded expectations, delivering close to $21 million for research into heart disease and other medical problems. Europe correspondent Emma Alberici. Three portraits of Picasso's different lovers fetched the night's three highest prices. It's been 70 years since this painting's been seen in public. While Marie-Therese Walter slept, Sydney University's dreams came true. The donor arrived from the United States um, with the picture in their hand luggage and said, I am just very keen to support your work. Here is um, this picture, which is a Picasso. There was no disappointment from the Australians in the room when the gavel went down on lot 47. The anonymous British buyer let his agent do the talking. Murray Therese will stay and rest in this country quite happily and then occasionally it will be lent to uh, exhibitions or to museums. Adding the buyer's premium, Sydney University will take home $20.6 million. A new centre will be built with a focus on obesity, diabetes and heart disease. Tonight's efforts have been fabulously important in helping us to recruit really star researchers to it. But there's a way to go, so if you do happen to have a spare Picasso that you wish to bring along in a black plastic bag at any point, then please do so, yes. This painting was part of a wider donation by this mystery American benefactor. It included cash and ten other paintings, jewellery and stock, which will all be sold to promote Sydney University as a world leader in medical research. Emma Alberici, ABC News, Christie's London.